crazy story out of the Georgia meteorite hunt from yesterday. Uh, so it was getting later in the afternoon. I was hunting with some friends of mine and a dad and his two kids, they're maybe 10 or 11 years old. They uh, walk up to us and they say, hey, do you mind if we go hunting with you? And of course, sure, that's great. The more the merrier. And we start looking around more. And I kid you not, 10 minutes later, I'm walking. The kid is five feet to my right. And I hear the dad yell, oh, my God, he found something. He found something. And I look over and he's walking up and picks up a stone from a bed of pine straw that's maybe about 200 or 250 grams. Um, and sure enough, yeah, he found a, a really nice, beautiful piece of the meteorite. And the funny thing is, as of now, it's the largest individual stone that's been recovered as far as I know of. So this 11 year old kid is probably the main mass holder from the McDonough, Georgia fall as of now. Um, there will be more stones to be found, maybe one bigger, but it's just wild. Um, I'm a dad. I have a kid. I get it. The dad and the kid were both so excited. It was really, really awesome to see. Um, I won't lie, a little bit of mixed feelings. Uh, if that kid wouldn't have found it a few seconds later, I probably would have. Um, I'm a sucker. I might have just given it to the kid or at least kept that one and given him one of the other smaller fragments I found. Just a really cool story. Uh, I love the meteorite community, the meteorite hunting community. It was um, a great day. A lot more stories to share from it, including about the pieces that I found.